morning everybody it is monday morning and i just woke up did a little skincare i'm in a great mood because i'm doing a video i have literally never done on my channel in 10 years i love doing vlogs and this is a vlog but i just want to change it up a little bit when i can you know add some spice so today we are doing an instagram followers control my day <laughs> i'm nervous because literally what i do today depends on your polls so if you don't follow me on Instagram, you should have been following me on Instagram so you could have been involved. <laughs> I know a lot of you guys are, so um, probably a lot of you guys are watching because you're like, I want to see how it all went. My Instagram is at Danielle Carolyn if you guys want to follow me there. Um, but yeah, so I just woke up. I lit All I did was wash my face and put on a robe, but now I need to figure out what I'm doing for coffee because normally I will make my coffee here and do that route. But now it's up to you guys. So I am I just posted on Instagram like, hi, I'm doing an Instagram, control my day, like just be on the lookout for polls today. So I guess I'll like take a picture of my coffee setup and be like, first up, should I go out for coffee or make it at home? Make it at home. I'm low key hoping that I can make it at home because I actually prefer making coffee at home, but it's up to you guys at the end of the day. So the poll has been posted. I'm gonna give it like two minutes and then we're gonna do it. I also really like to listen to music in the morning. So I'm like, what's my what's my playlist of the day? So I just took a picture of my Alexa. And I'm gonna say, what music should I listen to this morning? The thing is I do have to give options, you know? I'll do Jack Johnson or John Mayer, two J names, oh boy. All right, so I'm gonna post that too, just to kind of get the polls out there, you know? Get people working. Okay, let's see how the poll's doing. Go out for coffee is 47%, make it at home is 53%. I'm just gonna leave it for a little bit longer. We're gonna ice roll while we wait. You know that song, whistle while you work? I'm like, ice roll while you wait. <laughs> I'm like, nervous. Also, can we talk about how it's actually sunny outside today and my apartment is stunning and my mirror is killing it in the corner because it's reflecting light. I'm very happy. Okay, I'm still waiting on the coffee because it's kind of close, but this seems pretty obvious that they want me to listen to John Mayer, so we're going to do that. I'm not mad about it. I do love me some John Mayer. Let's get that on the uh, echo here. Yay! Okay, we're going to pause it really quick because... It's pretty much staying at 45.55 and I want coffee. So we're gonna make some, oh, this is some sourdough bread I got from the Union Square Green Market. I'm feeling very cool. <laughs> Let's turn this guy on, get him all ready. Also, someone literally just DM'd me and said, by the way, your creamer trick I stay doing now. It's actually my mom's boyfriend's trick that he taught me. If you use creamer instead of like, putting it in after and like getting a spoon. I just pour in, you have to kind of guess, but I pour in the creamer first, a little bit more. And I like let the coffee go through the cup with the creamer and it automatically mixes it in. So it's pretty fabulous. All right, we're gonna get it going. Brew, baby brew, let's go. Gonna light my candle. This is a Glossier U candle and it smells so good. Thank you guys for choosing Make Coffee at Home. I couldn't be happier. I'm not making breakfast yet. Um, I'm not really hungry just yet, but I do wanna get that pull up. So by the time it's time, by the time it's time, I'll know what I'm gonna eat. So I just took this little, this little selfie right here. Just a little, well, not even really of my face, just of my coffee. And I'm gonna, give some breakfast options. This is uh, pretty fun. Let's say avocado and eggs, or what else do I have? Oatmeal. Let's see what you guys pick. I'm really down for either, so I'm curious to see what everybody says. Okay, let's check in on the breakfast. All right, avocado and eggs is winning by 74%. Oatmeal is literally at 26%. <laughs> I was kind of excited for oatmeal, but that's okay. I love avocado and eggs. I literally have it every day. No problem. 
Okay, I need to go make my bed, but I kind of need to see where my day is taking me. I, in my head, fully planned on going, actually, because I'm an Equinox member, I wanted to go to the Equinox in Hudson Yards and work out there and then do the barrel saunas on the roof. That's like a whole journey. Um, but then I was like, you know, today's the day people control my day. So I should say, should I work out? Or go for a walk either way I want to like do something active so I'm gonna post a story I'm like worried I'm nervous should I go for a hot girl walk go work out I guess I guess it's up to you guys now I'm actually really curious to see what people choose I want to be mad if people said go for a walk I could totally do the gym another day and I'm working out a lot this week Oh, this one I'm like nervous for. I'm trying to like, so I was like avocado on eggs, like literally, obviously I should have figured, but I want to throw some curveballs in there that like, I don't know, like I want you guys to like make my day different than it was going to be, you know? Okay, let's go make my bed while we wait. Oh! Ta-da! Okay, so I literally just went down to get my mail in my robe and slippers. I just can't be bothered anymore, you know? So, for Christmas, I guess, like, the day I left, my mom's, like, favorite gift she got me came in the mail, and she was so upset, and I was like, well, can you just tell me what it is? Because she was so excited about this gift. Like, she's really hyped it up. <laughs> and she's like, no, 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 like, I want you to open it. I want you to FaceTime it. Like, she wanted to see it. So, it finally just came in the mail, and I'm going to call her right now. I hope she answers because I'm, I'm literally dying to know what's in this box. And if she doesn't answer, I have other packages that I can open. Oh my god! Oh, you got it! I have to open it. I'm dying to know. I was expecting this big box, so I'm excited to see. Oh my gosh, so much drum roll here. I know. You really talked. The package is cute, like the box. Yeah. yeah. I think it's kind of timely. Mika. Is that the Mika. brand? Yeah. I wrote something in there, girl. Oh, oh, sorry, girl. Merry Christmas and happy 2023. I love this bag. I do too. Oh, yeah. oh I yeah. dropped it. I'm nervous. <laughs> oh, another box. Okay, feels like jewelry. Oh. oh my God, it's so cute. Oh my God, guys, it's a GOTG necklace and it's gold. Oh my gosh, Brooke's gonna be so jealous. This is so cute. Why am I showing you? You've seen it. Mom, this is stunning. I mean, have That's, you ever thought about that? We've always thought about it. We just never executed it. That's so nice. Oh gosh, it's tangled. Oh gosh. Oh mercy. Oh mercy, you know me and the tangle. Oh, this isn't too bad, it's loose. Oh my God, Mom, this is so thoughtful. Thank you so much. Yes! That was so nice of my mom. I'm obsessed, I have to untangle. It got tangled on the way here, I think. Um, I want to do a little haul of the things I got in the mail and then we're gonna get back to the polls what first so I got this laptop stand I was I've always wanted one of these because apparently it's nice to type with like your arms elevated or whatever um, So this one it should be just like a clear laptop stand so we'll play with that later a couple random Amazon things This is my favorite toothbrush. I use it every day and it's great for travel my mom I got her one and she uses it purely for travel because it's electric, but it's um, Battery powered so you don't have to charge it which I love I literally have the yellow one. It's Philips Sonicare one I got to work with them one time and I still love it obviously so I just like bought another um, I also have never had one. This is a portable oral irrigator. Um, it's like a water pick situation and I've been flossing more but I don't know I'm just like doing all this research on like how your teeth and gum health can affect like other parts of your body um, Obviously like your gums are connected like to your head and all the things. I don't know. I'm just in my health era trying to be so I'm gonna try this out also from Amazon um, I want to start baking again after we recorded with Kellyanne on Gals on the Go, which you should listen to on Gals on the Go podcast because she's an amazing makeup artist, Makeup XKA. She gave a ton of tips. Um, well, one, I got these, Brooke has them, a ton of people have them on TikTok, like to bake your face or to set. Um, I actually used to use this. This is the Revolution Cosmetics Banana Light Baking Powder. Um, 
I just, when I was buying these, it was like suggested with, and I was like, oh, I actually used to use this, and I don't have a baking powder at the moment, so we're gonna try this situation, because my under eyes just like never stay bright. Um, so hopefully these Amazon powder puffs and the baking powder will do the trick. And then from Fenty Cosmetics, they actually sent me some PR. It's their Fenty Icon Semi-Matte Lipstick, but then it comes with this thing and you put, I think you put them in. So it's like refillable, which is really cool. I love Fenty Cosmetics, so thank you Fenty. All right, oh, well, we're gonna make breakfast. I'm pretty sure avocado and eggs is still winning. Oh yeah, 75% to 25%. So I think we're good to make breakfast. All right, time for breakfast, avocado and eggs. I got some eggs from the farmer's market yesterday, or two days ago. So I'm gonna make a couple eggs and avocado as you guys requested, told me to, I don't even know. I gotta find the ripest avocado. I think it's this guy right here. This looks fire flames. Thank you guys for the amazing recommendation. I think I'm going to watch some TV while I eat breakfast, but I need to decide what I'm going to watch while I eat it. Okay, I'm going to do Netflix or YouTube. I was going to do like Ginny and Georgia or something else, but I can't think of another option. So I'm going to, because I haven't, I just finished Emily in Paris, so that's out. So let's see, Netflix or YouTube. I'm hungry, so hopefully you guys respond fast. All right, YouTube is winning. I'm not mad about it. Clara Purse, one of my good friends and one of my favorite influencers, posted a new video I'm seeing, so I'm for sure gonna watch that right now. Yay, I can eat now. Okay, breakfast is done. I'm still watching Clara, but I need to figure out, I've been literally looking away, what I am doing today. Oh my God. Let's freaking go. Wow, I was fully planning on working out jokes on y'all. I'm going for a hot girl walk instead. Yay! Okay, so I need to, I wanna do the whole like, what outfit should I wear for my walk? It's freezing cold outside though. Let's look at the temperature. I just know it's cold because I'm cold inside, you know? 37, that's actually not too bad. And it's sunny, it doesn't, it was so breezy yesterday. I was freezing cold, but it's not breezy today. Okay, this is so crazy. My friend Jazz just texted me. We used to live really close to each other and we would go for walks together all the time. And she literally just texted me and she goes, do you wanna go for a walk this week? And I was like, well, I'm actually about to go for a walk. I'm doing this vlog today, whatever. And she is the most down person I know. She was like, yeah, sure, I'll do whatever. And I said, okay. I'm gonna do a poll though and say like, where should we walk? So I said either the West Side Highway or Soho and I said, is that okay with you if I like do this? And she goes, I love a choose your own adventure. I, she's the perfect person for this day. So she's gonna come along. I'm gonna post this just to like get it rolling so I can tell her where to like meet me. Um, so I said, where should I go for my walk? I did West Side Highway or Soho, like walk to Soho through Soho. So let's see. So I'm gonna send that over and um, I'm gonna pick up my outfit now. Okay, here are the two options I created. We have my pink outfit with the bar sweatshirt. I'll wear jackets over both of these, obviously. These are just the layers. Or black leggings with this Lululemon gray long sleeve and the North Face fleece. Okay, let's post a story. What should I wear? All right, I'm gonna post this either left or right. Let's go. I got my necklace untangled that my mom got me. GOTG, it's so cute. All right, it seems like you guys want me to wear the pink outfit. I actually wore this outfit the day of our first Gals and Go Live show too. So maybe it's got some good luck. I'll put it on. I guess you guys didn't want me to go neutral today and that's totally okay. All right, got my pink set on. It's from Set Active. I love it. Brush my teeth. I gotta fix my hair. I kinda wanna wear a hat so my ears don't get cold. Um, still need to figure out which location one. Jazz just texted me, she's like, so where are we going? I said, oh, okay, one sec. So cute, a nice little base layer. I'm gonna wear some like white crew socks, some sneaks, and probably my black Sam jacket, because that keeps me really warm. All right, 
We are just about ready. I am hopefully just gonna make everyone's day a little brighter with my very bright outfit. Um, yeah, what did I add? Oh, beanie from Boys Lie. I will link it below. It's so warm, it keeps my ears warm, and it's so cute. The pinks are like not perfectly matched, but that's okay. And then I'm wearing my APL sneakers. They've been really, really comfortable to walk in. And then, oh, I wanted to show you guys. I got these rechargeable hand warmers from Amazon. I had them charging all night, so I guess I'll turn them on and get them going. It's so nice, because you can just hold them in your hand like that. I have no idea how these are gonna work, but a lot of you guys recommended I get these instead of like, the disposable ones obviously so oh oh my gosh they're already warming up okay noted i guess these are like kind of instant rather than like the ones you have to shake and it kind of takes a second so i'm actually going to turn these off and wow that feels so good i cannot wait to use these outside um i'm going to turn them off for now they look like little like computer mouses but i will have these linked below for you guys they were not super expensive and they're so cute all right we're about to go i need to tell jazz where to meet me Let's see. Soho is the winner just by a few percentages, just by a few votes. So I guess we're walking to Soho. I'm gonna take a little ginger shot before we go. This is literally my walking buddy, this little lemon satchel situation. Cause I could just wear it and then my jacket over top is just right here with you. Woo! That feels great. All right. Putting my jacket on. This is a Sam jacket. It's literally so warm. Jazz is gonna be like, who are you? She's literally from Alaska, so. All right, cheers, let's go. Okay guys, I'm here with my walking buddy. We're on our hot girl walk. We're on our hot girl walk. As you guys told us, we are in Soho. And it's a lovely day, we're catching up. We literally haven't seen each other in so long. So long. So long, show me your new nails. I got purple, the red is out, purple is in. She apparently has been doing red for months. I didn't realize this. So I, I love this change. <laughs> panic and pick. I think that's like how you should do it. And that's what I do. As soon as I get there, I'm like, uh, what looks good? I don't know. Exactly. <laughs> so we're on our walk. I need to think of another like poll to do while we're on our walk, but I'll think. We're in Aritzia to pee because there's a bathroom up here, fun fact. Soho Aritzia. got back from my walk I forget what time we left for our walk but we went all the way to Soho and back I need to look at my phone because I think it tracks like how far we walked those hand warmers worked amazingly I literally felt like a mom on her walk just walking with them such such a great stable okay so today we've walked 7767 steps so far that's pretty good. Usually each day I get like about 10,000, so I already got like a lot in. Well, I guess if I go for a walk, it's more. But that's kind of like average if it's just like a chill day. So that's pretty good. I wish it said the miles, but I guess it won't tell me that. Woo! Okay, it is time for some lunch. So I just took this picture of my um, fridge. And I think I'm gonna use that. And I'm gonna say, I have like stuff I can make for lunch here, or should I order out? You know, I don't know. I've got HelloFresh that I can make, or I could order like kava or something. So I guess I'll make it broad though. Cook at home, Uber Eats something. I'm actually, I feel like you guys are probably gonna say cook. And I really want Uber Eats kava, but that's okay. We're just gonna, we're gonna see, all right. Here we go. Wait, not close friends. Here we go. Okay, I literally just ate a banana because I was so hungry, but I wanted to give it time to let the polls go. Everyone's saying cook at home. So I guess I could say like, which one should I make? But I kind of want to make this one. I'm just going to make this one. No one's going to care what I eat. <laughs> I'm sitting here in front of my heat dish that my dad got me because my apartment's just a little chilly, even though I have the heat on, don't worry, but this just feels so good. At first, my dad like surprised me with this and I was like, I do not need this. This is so silly but it feels like you're sitting by the fire, especially if you have just come in from a walk or something, you just thaw out a little bit. Oh, it feels so good. I don't wanna get up to make my lunch now, but I am hungry, so you know. We're gonna make these sesame soy pork bowls with sriracha mayo and crispy onions. I don't like sriracha or mayo, so that won't be happening, but I just edit things, you know, like this is just not gonna happen. But the ingredients seem pretty chill. The other HelloFresh meal I made the other day was like breaded chicken, mashed potatoes, it was delicious, but 
um, it was a whole thing. So this actually seems like it's going to be pretty easy. So you guys said cook at home. Here we go. Ta-da! It looks so good. The, those are like um, onions on top. I forget what they're called. Like crystallized, crispy fried onions. Um, got the rice and the pork. Hopefully it's good. I mean, I really enjoyed cooking that. It was really easy. And I just remembered I'm going to dinner tonight. So it's a good thing <laughs> that I cooked. <laughs> The results are in. That was fire flames. And now I have some leftovers for lunch or dinner another time this week, which is huge for the program. Delaney just texted me, who is literally my best friend. We were roommates in college. She just moved to New York, if you guys didn't know, um, that she is going to Bed Bath & Beyond. And I was asking her earlier, like, what are some fun polls I should do? Cause like, it is a Monday at the end of the day. And like, you know, it's fun to kind of take my everyday things I do and just kind of see what you guys want to see. But, you know, I should add a little spice in there. Not that this is super spicy, but she sent that to me. And at the same time, we both go, should I do a poll and see if I should come with you? Or, I'll, or I was going to clean my apartment, which definitely, like, needs to happen. But, you know, I know Delaney would probably, like, help going to Bed Bath & Beyond. I love a good Bed Bath & Beyond trip. I love the serotonin I get from apartment shopping. So I'm, I just posted the poll. Sorry, I did it without you guys. Um, just because she's about to like head over here. And, and if they say clean my apartment, then she's just gonna stop by and say hello. No hard feelings. Um, wow, I'm so happy that I have more food. I love leftovers. Fun fact about me. All right, let's check the results. Delaney's headed this way and she's like, are you helping me or not? <laughs> All right, oh yeah, 89% say Delaney, she's in luck. I really wasn't sure, because some people like like cleaning apartment content, so here we go. I just took my hair down and put my beanie on. Oh, at least the sun's out, wow, hello. I was planning on like, I, I truly actually wasn't planning on doing this, like this was not, I actually really have some stuff I need to get done and I'd like to clean my apartment, but you guys spoke, so. I will shower and clean later. No problem, it's fine, I'm fine. All right, we are off again to see Delaney. It's a good thing I didn't shower, wow. I found a Delaney. Hi. You look so cute. Thank you. So Thanks New York. Me, eh? What's, so what are we looking for today? Lots of random things. Random I things. a vacuum of sorts. A vacuum, yes you do. Um, I need a trash can for my kitchen because I still don't have one. Trash can, got it. I need what else? Like cookie sheets and like little things. Maybe some like storage bins under my Ooh, sink. Ooh, storage bins. We love yeah. that. Just right. I love it. This is like a boost of serotonin because you only get to do this like whenever you move. I know. So I'm selfishly excited. Forever. Like, yeah, as you'll, long just as here, so. you'll bring it. You'll bring it along. Stuff. I love it. efficient shopper ever I think that took like 20 minutes and now she's headed home easy okay I'm back I just put on lotion obviously took a shower and then I put on the lotion um, I've got two beverages going a Topo Chico and I just made some chamomile lavender tea it's just very cozy in my apartment and I don't know I'm actually like a little weirdly anxious right now I don't really know why just my chest is a little tight which is never a fun feeling so I made some tea Mm. But I'm going to dinner tonight with my friends Morgan and Mary Steven. They are some of my best friends from high school and still my best friends to this day. Anyways, I have like 40 minutes to get ready and my I had to wash my hair. It had to happen. So we're going to have to like blow dry my hair. But I think I'm going to do a poll and say should I do like straight or like blow out volume. I also need to pick out my outfit so... I'm just gonna take a little photo. Time to get ready. All right, I'm gonna post this and wait a second. I'm actually gonna start picking out two outfit options so you guys have time to pick my outfit so by the time I'm ready to get dressed, you guys give it to me. Okay, I'm really proud of myself. I would obviously wear both of these outfits but I tried to make them kind of different color schemes. I really could wear either one tonight so I'm excited to see what you guys choose. We have this one top is Aritzia, that's like the back of it. And then these cream pants, bag, shoes are from Vince Camuto. Assuming that they would look good together. If not, I'd have to switch the shoes. 
or a gray sweater dress. I'd wear tights and then these boots with this bag. So I'm gonna post now. All right, I'm going to post this now. I look really cute. All right, I'm about to check the results. Wow, I look, my hair looks like um, Portia from White Lotus. All right, let's see the results for my hair. Major volume is what people are wanting over straight. So we're gonna see what I can do. I have like no time to get ready. Wish me luck. I don't know why I did this to myself. It's gonna be hard to get some volume right now. Okay, I'm gonna finish like rounding out my hair once I'm done with my makeup. So I realize I'm gonna have to put my hair back anyways to do my makeup. Tonight we're going to a restaurant that I've been really wanting to try. It's called Hillstone. I believe there's more than one in the city. I think there's, I think I saw one in LA when I was there a couple weekends ago. Was it last weekend? I think it was literally last weekend, what am I saying? I think it's like an American restaurant. It's just got good vibes, good food, good drinks. Seems like kind of like an elevated cheesecake factory. I don't know, don't kill me. I don't know if that's right, but that's kind of what I have in my mind is what it is. I don't know, maybe someone described some, that to me as that. I don't really know, but I'm just trying to do my makeup super quickly. Are you ever doing your makeup and you're like, wow, I'm literally just going to dinner and then I'm coming back and taking it off? <laughs> that's that. There's a big Tampa Bay Bucks game on tonight. We're playing the Cowboys, the Dallas Cowboys. It's a playoff game. So if we lose, we're out. If we win, we go forward. So yeah, I kind of want to watch that. Maybe I'll do a poll like if we should all go watch it somewhere or if we should just watch it at home. I don't really know. I don't know if Mary, Mary Stephen and Morgan are like from Tampa and we've watched the games together before, but I, I don't really know where their head's at. It's a Monday night and they had off work today, so they might just want to like get ready for the work week. I don't really know. I know Ryan wants to watch the game, but like I know he'd go either way. Delaney mentioned it. So if there's enough people, it's fun to go out and watch the game. But if it's just like Ryan and I, more than happy to watch it at home. Just finished getting ready. It's now time to figure out what outfit I am wearing. Wow, it's pretty close. It's 42 to 58%. This one wins though. I'm excited to try it on. Okay, here is the look. I'm actually pretty proud with how the hair came out considering I had like no time. I tried to give it as much volume as I could. I used no straightener, I just used my Dyson Airwrap. Pretty simple makeup, didn't really do any eye makeup other than mascara. The top, this is the outfit you guys voted, is Aritzia, I love the back. Pants are also Aritzia. And then I tucked in these fun boots from Vince Camuto. It's a trend right now to tuck in your relaxed fit pants into boots. By the way, I'm not doing this randomly. I, I like how it looks. I think it's fun. And yeah, I like all the creams together. So we're going to head to Hillstone. Maybe I'll do a poll for like what I should eat to dinner, for eat for dinner. I don't even know what the menu looks like, but yeah, maybe we'll do a poll there. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, really sad. We were about to go and Hillstone doesn't take reservations and I was like, let me just call them. Two hour wait. So I called the girls. I was like, no, we're not doing this. So we're actually going to go try a place called Jack and Charlie's. I got us a reservation there at 6.15. We wanted to go to dinner at 6 because the Bucks game is at 8. Well, they don't know that. That's my reasoning, but that's my reasoning. Um, so it's perfect. It's going to be okay. Here we go. My dinner was absolutely lovely. Honestly, Jack and Charlie's is so cute. The Bucks game is on tonight. We're in the playoffs. And Ryan and I were just gonna watch it on the couch. But I'm all dressed up and Ryan's in the mood too. So we're gonna go to Down the Hatch in West Village and watch like the first half there and get like a beer. And then I'll probably go home, but just have a little West Village night. got home we left at halftime as planned the Bucks are just terribly losing but I'm gonna keep watching the game while I fold laundry I did not realize how much of a mess I left my apartment I think because I all of a sudden realized I didn't have much time to get ready so I just kind of 
made it super messy in here. So love that for me. Can't wait to clean it up. Um, but you know, that's okay. I have more laundry. I did three loads of laundry throughout the day. So I have to take this stuff out of the dryer too and fold it. But I love folding laundry and watching TV. It's like a treat for me. I don't know why. And then I have one more thing that was in the wash that I need to put in the dryer. So, yeah, I was trying to think on my way back of any more pulls I could do. But, like, I simply have to fold laundry before it, like, gets wrinkly. So I'm not going to do, like, oh, should I do this or fold laundry? Like, I have to fold laundry. And I have to wash my face. And I have to put on pajamas. And, like, I could do what pajamas am I wearing. But, like, whatever. So we're just going to get cozy. Might make a little hot tea. And we're going to do some laundry and watch TV. Having a little bit of blueberries for dessert. Got the game on. Heat dish is going. It's confirmed the heat is not working in the building, or at least on my floor, because my next door neighbor texted me and said, is your heat working? And I said, uh-oh, me neither. Thought it was just my unit. So I'm really glad I have this. I'm gonna fold laundry. Well, my friends, the Bucks have lost, but all of my laundry, well, almost all of my laundry has been folded. Um, I just have to put one more load in the dryer, and then we are donezo. I got a, a surprise FaceTime from Kelly. She literally just landed in America. She was in Korea and Japan, so we were just catching up. And um, I'm always so honored when someone calls me like right after their trip because you get the fresh like she literally just got back from the airport so I got like the fresh ketchup like whenever I do a trip both of my parents I feel like are like I want to talk to Danielle because whoever I talk to first even if it's not my parent they get the freshest recap they're probably gonna get all the details am I making sense like because then every person after that you kind of like start to take out details because you're like oh I've told this a couple times it's just how it is unfortunately so I feel like talking to Kelly tonight I was so honored because I just got to hear like everything um not that she's gonna go in depth for other people too but I don't know whatever I'm gonna put away all my laundry take some melatonin and go to bed I really can't think of any more polls to do so I hope you guys enjoyed this day I want to do another one on like a weekend when I'm like with Ryan or a friend or someone and it's more like crazy like should we go to Brooklyn or like Governor's Island today or something like that. More like crazy stuff. I know today was more mundane things, but I was just testing out the waters. So I think I'm liking it. This was fun. If you guys liked it, give this video a thumbs up, comment down below and I'll do another one. I love you guys. I'm just like wanting to kind of get more creative with videos while still making them vlogs, you know? So hopefully this was a fun mix and I'll see you guys this Sunday for my next video. Bye.